Swashes away, it's over. Just over the man at point of zone. That's four. He's been caught there once. He's got this one away, and that's cool for a bowl. This time he drops him short. That's four. Beautifully played. Charge. Oh, he's making him play. That's a great shot. One bounce over the fence. And this uh, has been finished by Darren Goff, who's uh, he's given Gilchrist some problems. Over Nasser Hussain's head and away to the boundary. Big shout there. There was a noise. And it's been given by umpire Hare, so Vince Wells has only been used sparingly so far in the Carlton United series. Getting a breakthrough. Getting a... Oh, and uh, that one down the leg side, and lovely shot. It was well pitched up, and uh, at the end of the day, it was quick too. Oh, and that's out. He's got him caught behind. Well, I think that may have to play a little bit, but Wall once again looked as if he was going down the wicket to him. Run over the top and he's done that very well. That's a big one. That's a six. Sweet timing. Oh, that's a noise. <laughs> it, it, it was a noise uh, not so much uh, to be heard through one's earpiece, but uh, with the what you might term the naked ear. This is a big nick. Much bigger than that. I haven't seen uh, that very often from Michael Bevan. He's pulled one right out of the hat there. Oh, there he's got underneath that one and he's placed it pretty well. It's going down towards deep, but wicket for four. Well, that's his fifth boundary. Chance in the outfield. Ben Holyoke underneath it. And he catches them a little better than his brother. Caught that very easily. Well, we're only into the 44th over. Suddenly there are seven down. Uh, that's a bit of a waste. And then Julian out for 12. Well, that's a handy one for Australia. Shane Warren's got it fine. And got it away to the boundary. Goss has been ready to bowl for quite a while. Yeah. Oh, that's a magnificent shot. Timing and placement, perfect. Well, well bowled. Darren Goff going right through Shane Warne. Darren Goff producing that Yorker. Right on line. Dale's coming back for the second. He left uh, pretty early. And he's back comfortably. So 232 for Australia. The loss of eight wickets from the 50 overs. Bevan with 69 not out in his 95th one day, underlining his brilliance in the limited over arena. Australia eight for 232. That's a better shot. That's six. That's a good start. That's way back. Oh, great shot. Beautifully played. What a shot. That was short. He looks as if he uh, means business of the evening, Alex Stewart. So, Stewart going well. He's gone to 15 off just 12 balls. He's gone again. That's... Oh, dropped a hot chance. Could still very well run for four. It was red hot. It looks like he's broken a finger. I say that's a broken finger. It's a four. And that's uh, Michael Bevan, I'm sure, with a broken finger. That's gone! Yes, that caught him. That's out, surely. Mark Wall there, Stuart standing. Well, he wants to see this on replay. The umpire's conferring. Well, the captain, he was a good, good view of this, Stuart. He was short at mid-wicket. Yes, uh, that'll be a big disappointment for Stuart because uh, he'd really got him going out there and <laughs> once again McGraw couldn't help himself. Uh, I think it, it all got the better of him at the end of the day and uh, then when McGraw reminded him, <laughs> that was it. So Alex Stewart has got him off to a fly-up. Oh! Well, he's hit the stumps at both ends. 
He knocked the bales off with his finger at the uh, non-striker's end, and then he beat um, Nick Knight's slog shot and crashed into the stumps at the striker's end. Brendan Julian to come on now. That's a very good shot. He's really just given that a helping hand around behind square leg. It's two for 97. Isn't that great? That is one of the loveliest pieces of fielding you will see. A moment of indecision from Nasser Hussain and Graham Hick. It's gone! Beautifully bowled. Genuine edge. The ball moved off the seam. Fair brother folded. Once again, McGuire has done the job for his team. He's got hold of that one, and he's going for four, he's hit that like a rocket. Well that one's short, and uh, it leaves the pressure a little bit, and he's hit that one beautifully. Well that's into the uh, fence for four. Thank you, Tony Gregg, Lehman continues. It's, it's gone for that, and it's gone all the way, that breaks the shackles. That's a big hit. Sands on strike. Can you believe that? Warren comes back with two overs to bowl. He tries to hit him out of the ground. The game's open again. Ah! Sweet shot. He's given in. Well, how about that? First ball, Holyoke attempts to sweep. Front pad, he gives in. That's just the second flip of Warren has landed during the summer. He's gone for a duck. And the game's wide open. Six for 198. Sit that in the air, is it? Julian, Julian, Julian! Yes, what a catch! Julian run 20 metres, but under it. And that's a key wicket. Superb outfielding by the Australians. You'll spot that he deceives the batsman with the slower ball, a beautiful slower ball. Has him playing, instead of playing a low skimming drive, he's hit it in the air, and Julian has taken a blinder. 101 kilometers an hour, so it was a slow delivery. I think he picked it okay. But look at Julian go running with the ball. That's a superb outfield catch. That's one day cricket at its best. Australia now favourites here. All of a sudden, it's all turned around. Rolls out for well made 43. Another dot ball. It's gone. He's got the edge. A disappointing end for Elon Well bowled McGrath. Got him. Knocked him over. Superb bowling. The Yorker. Not scoring for duck. It's all but over at the Sydney Cricket Ground. That's down to the line over his head. It's four. No, Croft. The Welshman. Alan Mulroney and Robert Croft. Need 12 off the last over from Gwen McGrath. Croft. Whoops. Oh, if he hits, he's gone. He misses. Oh, they're still alive. Oh, he could have almost run him down. McGrath knows it. The pressure's on everybody here at the Sydney Cricket Ground. The crowd cannot believe it. Ball in, middle stump. The great McGrath, that's the job for Australia. The end of a wonderful final. Well, just when it looked as though England would cruise home, the collapse came. Five for six in the space of 22 balls. Australia by 10 runs. McGrath was absolutely brilliant with four for 45 to equal Dennis Lilly's record of 25 wickets in a one-day series, but he had at least...